Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, non-binary folks of the interweb, welcome to our Back to My Channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. We're all stuck in quarantine. Um, just, just like a little bit crazy. Just like a little, just, mm, just, can you relate? You know, it's just the situation of the current moment. We're all going through this. I think it's a beautiful thing that we're all kind of going through this together. Everything in my life kind of just like came crashing down all at once and I will get into that in this video but I've realized that there is simply one solution one thing that I have control over and that is my hair I know what you're thinking why is everyone freaking dyeing their hair shaving their heads freaking sticking poking themselves some tattoos in this time well it's because we're bored and we feel like we have no control and we feel like the only thing we have control over is our physical appearance so why not change it up or do something because it's like we're all kind of like going crazy and like we need to like change something to like make us feel like more secure in ourselves um so that's kind of what's going on and so for today's video I never thought that it would come to this for me. I wanted to dye my hair for like a really, really long time, but I've never actually like considered doing it, especially because I'm a model and my agents would freak the freak out, but I'm not with my agency anymore. So they have zero control over my life and I can do whatever I want with my appearance. That's why I chopped off my hair a few months ago. Best decision I've ever made. That's why I've gotten tattoos. Best decision I've ever made. And now I've decided that it's time to freaking bite the bullet and just dye my hair. You know what I mean? Like, what do I have to lose? It's just hair, it'll grow back. <sighs> I have a million things to say, a million things to get you guys up on. So without further ado, subscribe if you're new and let's get straight into the video. Okay. Here is the situation. I am obsessed with TikTok. Obsessed with TikTok. I love TikTok. TikTok is the superior social media, in my personal opinion, at this current moment. I love making TikToks. Love watching TikToks. During this quarantine, I've been consuming so many hours of TikTok. It's like almost embarrassing. Like I don't want to look at my screen time. So with that being said, there are so many beautiful, stunning, amazing, gorgeous human beings on TikTok that just blow my mind. And they all just have really, really cute dyed hair. And I just have decided that I have to do that i have to dye the front part of my hair because this is the cutest shit i have ever seen in my entire life you cannot tell me that this is not the cutest thing that you have ever seen in your entire life i actually like can't believe i'm actually doing this like i have never ever ever dyed my hair like i've never even dyed a strip of my hair like i've never even dyed it like a fake cut. like never never once like i have completely virgin hair my mom is going to absolutely kill me and uh she's downstairs right now and she doesn't know i'm doing this so we're definitely gonna get her reaction after this i think it's gonna look really freaking cute you know i gotta i gotta think for a second so it's been about 40 minutes of me sitting and staring at a wall with my thoughts and I've come to the conclusion that yes, this is a good idea. 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 We're just gonna open this up. This is Color Freedom Cream Bleach. You know, I think my greatest uh, desire and dream in life is for Brad Mondo to react. So if Brad Mondo is watching this, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Okay guys, so this is my hair. So the reason that I think that this is gonna look good is because my hair actually has naturally been kind of lightening in the sun a little bit and it looks pretty cute every time that I look like a little bit blonde. So I think that this little front part being blonde is gonna be a good look. So you said you wanted me to make an appearance in the video. Not I'm right just... now! What the f So this is the only bleach that they had at Target, like the only one. It was like the last box, so I think a lot of people are... You know, I think we're all, we're just, we're all going through it. This is the Knight and Wilson Color Freedom Cream Bleach. We have conditioning treatment and we have developer. What does all that mean? I don't know. So we're going to look it up and we're also going to read the instructions because we're not stupid. Okay. It's 50-50 cream bleach, cream developer. So, here. Gloves first, ladies and gentlemen. That's definitely not gloves. <sighs> Slow down. Oh. 
Okay, I'm not gonna ruin that shirt. But I'm, always, I'm mostly nervous, but I'm a little bit excited as well. I'm mostly excited. Uh, I'm mostly nervous, but mostly a little bit excited. Can you show? Oh, are you filming? Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Hi, hold on. We're, we have to have time. She didn't even notice. <laughs> she didn't even. <laughs> she didn't even notice the freaking hair dye. Doesn't question anything. Like. <sighs> You know, it's a sign that everything is okay and we're just gonna... <laughs> okay, I'm opening this. Lightning cream. I don't know how much to put. Like, I really don't, but we're... Uh, all right. I'm only doing the front two spots, so I feel like I don't need that much. Also, it smells really bad. Oh! Oh! Lots of plastic going on here. I'm not proud of that. I'm very much not proud of that. All right, let's section off my hair. I don't know how much I want to do because a few girls have like literally like the tiniest little pieces and it looks really good. But then some girls have like thicker little like actual strips and that also looks very good. So let's first part my hair into the center. You know what's really funny about this is that this is kind of unexpected for me because I feel like the majority of my content is like very like positive and you know, I mean not that this isn't positive, this is a very positive situation and activity that we're currently in. I'm just, I'm just really going through it. I'm, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I am really going through it right now. I have a lot to update you guys on. I guess this is just how we're gonna do it. So, oh my god, they look so good! <laughs> so, this is the question Question's that up. I have for you. So you see like this girl, she has like actual like strips, but like, it's, okay. I'm pretty sure it's only the front part. So this, she didn't do, right? Right. Like that, it would just be this. Yeah. Like, like this is such a specific look with like where they do the little highlights in the yeah, front. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. But aren't you doing like pink or something or no, purple? I'm just doing the highlights. Oh, you're just doing I was going to do it like my whole head blue, but like I just want to do this instead for now. Yeah. Mm, for now. I'm, I'm going to do my whole head blue. Turn into ninja. Yeah, I see it. I don't, yeah, I think it'll look interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'll look uh, interesting. <gasps> Just looking at these photos, it really seems like you could like really mess it up. See, bro? <laughs> Like, just go nuts. Like, if you're gonna dye her, just f***ing dye her. That's hair. what I'm thinking. It's like a I guess it's a good way to start, and then if it's bad, you can always go in the other direction. You could just, I could just dye my whole head. Yeah. And just like, dye to color. Have you told your, um, your followers that you're having a mental breakdown? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just but, like, kidding. The thing is, is that he's not kidding. I've alluded to it, but I have to mention that, like, I have been crying for, like, multiple days. <sighs> <laughs> Um, and how do you fix it? Hair hair. <laughs> the thing is, some of this is my prior bangs and some of it is just hair. It's like very uneven. We're gonna put a little bit of coconut oil just because that's what I read that you should do on the internet. And like the internet like never lies. Like everything that you read on the internet is true. Coconut oil is on. Brad Mondo says not to do the roots first, so we're just... Oh! Gloves. Alright, it's 11.28. I'm gonna wait 20 minutes and then I'm gonna do my roots. Ah! All right guys, it's been 20 minutes, so I'm going to do my roots now. Ah! Uh-oh, uh-oh, I got it on my other hairs. Ah! Wow, this is legit. I get it cracking like a bad wag. I get it cracking like a bad bag. We're just gonna leave this because um, this way I can like at least talk. This is ridiculous. Like, 
Okay, so basically I'm just gonna tell you guys because I feel like like I owe it to you guys. Like you guys are my support system. You guys are my family. You guys know everything about my life. And like, I'm the one who kind of, I did that to myself, you know? Like I've chosen to share my life with you guys. I've chosen to share my relationship with you guys. And so it's like only fair for me to tell you guys what's going on in my life and give you guys that like update. So recently my boyfriend and I of three and a half years decided that we are going to separate and the first thing of course that i want to say is that like there's nothing that happened between us like we literally both mutually decided that we both need to grow on our own because of the place in our lives that we were both individually at i mean like we've been together since we were 16 and we're both 20 now so it's like that time we've grown together a lot and we've gone through a lot and a lot and a lot of shit together but like i also have to learn how to like do things on my own right so i love him with all my heart i always will he's my first love and that's just what i'm going through right now someone just said more split more bleach or else it will be splotchy on my private friends instagram story so i'm gonna put more am i putting way too much now this is do not do this at home i repeat do not do this at home i repeat Okay guys, it's definitely been a long enough time. So I'm gonna go wash this out. <laughs> this is where we're at. It's obviously pretty patchy. I'm not that mad about it. It's obviously just like really orange. So I'm gonna do a second little process to lighten it more with this like extra bright whitening bleach stuff. I want it to be lighter. About my relationship is we had a really, 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 really beautiful relationship. Like he is one of the most amazing and caring and nice and incredible people I've ever met in my entire life. And you guys could probably tell from my videos the type of guy that he is the best boyfriend that i could ever ask for and i think it's just a matter of us needing to go on our own ways for a while and it really sucks that i have to talk about this on the internet because it's really personal to me you guys are my people and you obviously deserve to know what i'm going through and especially in a relationship that was so public so that's my current situation with that obviously there's just a lot that i have to deal with go through and figure out on my own and um, it's gonna be okay. Anyways, I just heard my mom's voice and I locked the door. Oops. So this is giving me major Dua Lipa vibes and I'm so happy about it because I freaking love her. Wait another 20 minutes and then I'll do the roots and then we'll be set. <sighs> Anyways, what other updates do I have for you guys? Um, I'm working on something really exciting. I'm like literally so excited. Like I just can't wait to tell you guys. I know every YouTuber says that, but I just have to say it too because I'm so excited. Other than that, I've just been, I've been taking a lot of time for myself, especially during this quarantine, like just spending a lot of time with my family, making hella TikToks because I'm addicted to TikTok, as I mentioned before. If you guys haven't followed me on TikTok yet, please. This is really empowering though, because like for four years of my life, like I couldn't change my appearance at all because my modeling agency. And now the fact that I can just dye my hair with no repercussions, like it just, it feels so freeing. Like I'm so happy about it. Right before the lockdown, I was like surfing so much and I feel like my surfing's really improving. And so like once I'm like legally allowed to surf again, I'm gonna get clips and I'm gonna make more surf vlogs. Like I, I'm going to do it, I promise. I promise, and I don't make promises lightly. Surf vlogs are coming. Okay guys, I'm going to wait for this to lighten and I'll talk to you soon. You know what the worst thing that could happen is? The worst thing that happens is my hair completely fries, right? And then it just looks horrible. Then, at least my roots will grow out and they'll be healthy-ish. And then I can just cut bangs and just cut off this part. That wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. I've had bangs before. Uh -oh. But I'm really excited. Like I feel like this is gonna give me a whole new vibe that I'll just be able to go off of. And then like from there, 
like I'll create new makeup looks, I'll be all inspired. You know, this is a good thing. Change is good. Me literally trying to convince myself that this is a good idea. For about 10 more minutes, then I'll wash this out, then it'll dry, and hopefully it will be there. Maybe. All right guys, I washed it out, and now I'm gonna put purple shampoo. Okay, five more minutes. You know what'd be fun? Is if I could have some friends here to do this with me. Okay. Speaking of quarantine, how are you guys doing? Have you gotten to this point yet? No, in all realness, guys, this is a really, really good time for us to take for ourselves, you know? Like, I think self-care during this time is so, so, so important. Like, I am joking about, like, all of this and saying, like, oh, like, dyeing my hair as a coping mechanism type thing, but truthfully, like, it's just fun to dye your hair. I am, and I hope you guys are, taking real measures to take care of yourself during this time. And I think I'm actually gonna make a video of some self-care things that we can all do in quarantine. So let me know if you guys wanna see that, but of course I wanna say that and just also, like, be a little bit serious because this is a really serious thing that's going on. My heart goes out to people who have lost family, friends. It's really a tough time and I think that we have to stay strong and united in this time and we have to be there for one another and check on one another and make sure that we're all okay. You know, so this whole social distancing, I think that it's important that we physically distance, but I think we should really be FaceTiming our friends, checking in on one another, being there for one another, and sending our love to everyone in the world that needs it. And also just being very, very grateful for people working in healthcare, people working in hospitals, people working in grocery stores, working overtime at the jobs that people can still be working at. Those people are working really, really hard right now. So like my heart goes out to them and I'm just, I'm rooting for them and I'm so grateful for everyone. Because if there weren't Target workers, I wouldn't have been able to get this hair dye. All right, let's wash this conditioner out. It looks orange. All right, I'm gonna let this dry and I'll be back. <laughs> guys, I do. <laughs> Here's the final look, you guys. I actually really, 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 really like it. It looks pretty bad, but like, it's like, I like it, you know? It's obviously really, really, really orange. So I have to get some toner, but you know what? I like it. I think it looks pretty cute. And once it's toned and a little bit more blonde, like I think it'll be cuter. I'm really happy. Like I feel very confident and I feel very like new. Like this whole flipping situation is like kind of a vibe. If you want to dye your hair, do it. Just f***ing do it. Like who, like literally who cares? Also this makes me kind of want to be blonde. But that's it for today's video. I love you guys all so much. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching this video. I'm gonna go show my parents so we'll get that reaction. Wait, let's let's do that real quick. It looks orange.